For this video, we are going to show how to construct a line segment whose length is equal to the sum of the lengths. Basically, that means we're going to add. Now, when you take two lines, I think of it as just taking two sticks and adding them together into one long stick. Uh, and it actually says construct a line segment whose length is equal to the sum of the lengths. There's kind of a, a cheater shortcut way to do this, and that's just take one of these and move it on to the other one. And that's what I'm going to do in this case. Just, it's kind of the easier version. Uh, a more you know, standard version is you draw a whole line and then you put both of the segments, you copy both of the segments onto the larger line. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take one of these lines, I'll start with the top one, and I'm going to extend it. Now I like to extend my lines with like a dotted line, just saying like I'm not actually going that far, but this is the direction that I want to add on the other line. So I'm going to put it somewhere on this dotted line here. The only thing is I need to know how far. Well to figure out how far, again I need to figure out the copying of that segment. So I'll darken my endpoints a little bit here, 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 and here just so I have all my edges or the endpoints a lot easier to see. So I'm going to start with this one. I'll anchor the wheel right on that. So the wheel is now anchored in the middle there. And then I can see right about here is that dark end point. I gotta find a hole that goes through that. It looks like this hole's pretty close. Let's check the other side. That's kind of in between two holes. So I'm gonna go back to the original side and I'm gonna go to this hole that went right through it. Now just to make sure that's right on there. So that hits right at the edge. So that's the hole that I'm gonna use. Now, oh, well which hole was that? got to go back and check. Looks like it was this one if I count backwards that's one, two, three, four, five, six. That's the sixth hole. It's also right before this one and a half. So then I'll move the wheel and now for this wheel I'll have it right there anchored on the end of that. And I'm going to go to that one and a half mark again. The one, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll mark this arc. So from this point to this arc is the same. It's a copy of this one right here. So then all I have to do is use my straight edge. I'll go along that same line. And there we go. So now I've added, let's call this like, if this was, I don't know, about five units long, and then this was six units long, and then I put the six units up here. Now all together that would be 11 units because I added them together. So that's how you add two segments together. 